about collapsing that game. If I sit here from this position, right? I'm sitting here and I'm striking. I'm the one who's on the wall, let's say. I'm sitting here and I'm striking and he comes into me and I go from here, go ahead. I go from here and I swim my underhook. Is my face open? Oh yeah. So he's gonna just basically sit up at that point and just throw that hook right into my head, okay? This isn't wrestling. I'm not trying to swim underhooks from a distance here, where as soon as I come through here, he gets the underhook, now he just turns that into a right hook, and I'm done. Or he turns it into an elbow, depending on the range, okay? I want him to collapse. If he collapses me in, boom, guess what? He tries to throw that hook, that elbow, my hand's right here, but my elbow at any point rolls through. I want my hand still here. I want him to collapse me. If you get get sloppy and you turn this in, uh -huh. you turn this in here. Uh -huh. I want you to I want you to pay the cost. Uh -huh. okay. okay. So yeah. So here, boom. So you're in here. So if I decide to break off and I just start going here, you're fine. You're fine. But if I press in again, well, you're up. Okay. So as he collapses into me. He's breaking that posture, or he's, he's pinning me up against the wall. I have to get my leg to the outside, and I have to get my elbow swim underneath, which is why your elbow has to be below his armpit. Here like this, this guy charges in. You know, boom, I'm in here like this, and I start dropping the posture. Everybody's like, oh, he can grab your legs. Okay, so he goes for the legs. From here, I'm fine with that. I have no problem with that. The moment that he does, anything that was on my belt line becomes free. So you get me down, that's fine. You're gonna you're gonna get whatever was in my belt line. Okay, it's probably gonna be either a gun or a knife. So in an MMA environment, in a sport environment, absolutely, certainly nothing wrong with that. Certainly practical. But if you're talking about a weapon space environment or a weapon possibly exists, when we're talking about reality based training. One thing that you do need to condition yourself for is as this guy comes in, boom, and he drops to the legs, my default is to drive down and to go to my weapon. I have no problem with you doing whatever. Like, you can get the takedown. That's fine. It makes no difference to you. But you're going to get whatever it was that I was protecting. And that's why we're here. That's why my elbows come down to my hips. Okay? God made them that way to defend your weapons.